Hello. Happy New Year. 2024 is here. I am back again. The snippets with Shay. I want to talk to you today about Haggai 2 and 9. When God told Haggai to tell the people, people that their latter shall be greater than their former. And I just want to talk to you today about letting the past be in the past. 2023 was a good year because we're still living and God saw us through it. No matter what we went through, no matter what we experienced in that year, he brought us through it. And that I can say I'm grateful and thank you. But 2024 is here. 2023 is gone. So don't let your former, don't let your former take away from your ladder. God said in his word, it's your ladder shall be greater. God do not lie. He has to do what he says he will do. And that his word holds true to us. His word is for us also. So I just want to say to you today, I hope that your new year will be great, will be awesome, will be blessed, will be prosperous. But most of all, put God first in this year. You may have put him first last year, and that is wonderful. But put him first. Let him be the forerunner of your life. Love him. And let him love you. I just want to say that we have to be about his business. The years are coming and going. But are we doing what God wants us to do? Let this year be a prosperous year. Not in things, but in God. Let God use you. Let him Use you to his glory. Become kingdom minded. Let us be kingdom minded more and more as the years go forth. Just think about this. Just think about God's glory reigning in the earth. And God's glory reigning in you and reigning in me. Reigning in your home. Oh my God. God, that is the best thing ever. And I just want it to be not only for me, but for you. That's the reason I do these snippets, because I want someone, if it's only one, to know that God loves you and he wants to do great and mighty things for you, through you and in you. But first, we have to give our lives to him. If you haven't given your lives to God, please do that. Please make that a priority this year. Make it a priority right now. Just do it right now. Just just say, God, I'm sorry. I'm sorry for everything that I've done. Jesus has already died on the cross for our forgiveness. All you have to do is admit Confess your sins and ask God to renew you, to come into your life and restore you unto him. Just repent. That means to turn away from everything that is not of God. Well, how do I know what is of God and what is not? Open up the Bible. Open up the app on your phones. There are all kinds of ways that we can get the word nowadays. Search for him and search his scriptures and you will know what he wants. And if you have given your life to God and you are living for him and you love him, live like it more and more in 2024. I love you. This is Snippets with Shay. Bye-bye.